puberty is a time for lots of emotional changes too. Sometimes puberty can be confusing, and it's normal to have lots of questions. It's good to know about the changes that come along with puberty before they happen. So let's talk about the top 10 things you can expect when you go through puberty. What is puberty? Does everyone go through it? What happens? Puberty is the time when your body changes and develops from a kid to an adult. Puberty is something everybody goes through. Here's what happens. In your head, just below your brain, is a small P-shaped gland called the pituitary gland. When the time comes, it releases two hormones. In girls, the chemicals target the ovaries. Since birth, the ovaries have contained eggs. The hormones stimulate the ovaries to begin producing another hormone called estrogen. Estrogen causes a girl's body to mature and prepares her for pregnancy. So, let's review. During puberty, you have all these hormones going through your body, and everybody goes through it. You understand that it's the hormones that turn you from a kid into an adult. When the hormones are released, there's one thing you can expect to happen. Your ovaries will begin producing estrogen, and that changes everything. When does puberty start? When does puberty end? Does it hurt? Someone told me it hurts. For girls, puberty starts sometime between the ages of 8 and 13. Some people start earlier, some start later. Everybody is on a different schedule. During that time, you can go through a growth spurt, a time when your body grows really fast. This growth is the last time your body will grow taller. After that, you'll be at your adult height. So, during puberty, expect to grow taller. One day, I get up and I have this huge pimple on my chin. Is that normal? Does eating chocolate cause acne? Can you squeeze it? People say you shouldn't, but my sister does. How do you stop acne? Another thing that comes with puberty is acne, or pimples, often referred to as zits. Hormones that stimulate the production of oil in the skin trigger acne. Do not touch or squeeze the acne. It helps to keep your skin clean. And the good news about acne is that it usually gets better or disappears after adolescence. Why does your body need hair on your legs, underarms, and your private areas? Is that hair really necessary? Is hair supposed to grow everywhere? One of the first signs of puberty is having hair growing in places it didn't grow before. Hair will grow under your arms and in your pubic area your legs and arms. Some girls may want to start shaving their legs right away. Others may want to wait until they're much older or not shave them at all. It's different for everyone. Whenever you start, be sure to go slowly. You can cut yourself if you go too quickly. My hair looks like I wash it with oil. It's gross. What is going on? Well, the hormones that create acne can also make your hair oily. Washing your hair every day can help control oily hair. You can also try a conditioner for oily hair. So here's what you need to know. Just about everyone gets pimples or acne. Hair grows in different places all over your body, and your hair will get and feel oily. When do girls begin to grow breasts? My jeans don't fit right anymore. Am I getting fat? 